And today our story begins with some guy standing in front of the front door and asking permission to enter. It turns out that he lives in a neighboring apartment and wants to talk to someone from this apartment. The guy's name is Kim Namju, and he is 27 years old. The boy moved here three months ago, and since they didn't answer him for so long, he decided to try later. He has lived here for quite an impressive period of time, and he has absolutely no complaints about his apartment, but the neighbors turned out to be simply terrible. Further actions are transferred to three months ago, when our boy was going to throw out the garbage. Noticing his neighbor who was doing the same thing as him, the main character hurried to say hello and tell him that he had recently moved here. The girl doesn't really intend to leave her apartment and just says hi to the boy. After which she simply begins to leave, and the main character can only look after her, thinking that she is simply beautiful. After about two weeks, the boy tried to eat that same food, but he just couldn't do it. Still, our boy constantly ate food from delivery, so it's not surprising that he simply can't stand it anymore. Maybe he should go to the store for some normal food. Suddenly on the left, he again meets his neighbor who was typing the password on her door. This time it was a completely different girl, so the main character thought that they were just living together. The boy was just going to say hello, but the door instantly slammed right in his face. Of course, he didn't like such a terrible act, but still he tries to restrain his anger, saying that most likely the girl simply didn't hear him. After one week in the greenhouse, he was just calmly going about his business on the common balcony when he suddenly heard strange sounds. It turns out that at that time, one of the girls was not sleeping, and as soon as she saw the main character, she immediately began to get scared. Not even a second has passed before the door in front of his face once again turns out to be closed and there is no trace of the girl. All the same, the boy begins to understand that this time the girl had a completely different appearance. Did they really decide to live together? Next, the actions move forward another week when the boy calmly walked to his home. He walks along without touching anyone, when suddenly he receives a strong blow from Saitama right on the head. Of course, from such wild pain, he immediately sits down on his knees and holds his head. Behind him stood a girl who was trying to understand what had happened, and the main character did not understand why the hell they were opening the doors so suddenly. This time it was some blonde girl who immediately asked for forgiveness for hitting him. As in all other cases, the girl is not going to stay here for long, so she immediately returns to her apartment. Our boy named Kim once again just has to stand and try to understand what the hell is going on here. In this way, 9 days passed, then 21 days, and then even more time, and each time someone new appeared in this apartment. Next, we are shown the main character who sits in front of his monitor and tries to figure out what the hell is going on here. At one point, his nerves can't stand it, and he simply leans back in his chair and starts screaming loudly, as if he's gradually losing his mind. Just the thought that by some miracle, 10 people could live in that damn apartment at once drove him crazy, and the main character couldn't even concentrate on his work. The boy understands perfectly well that at this rate, he will simply go completely crazy, and he even thinks that he needs to go and ask directly. All the same, he decides to visit them tomorrow morning, just as something suitable appeared at hand. It turns out to be a gift box that the main character has been sitting idle for too long. He definitely doesn't intend to eat it, so he will solemnly hand it over to them. In this way, he will be able to get rid of unnecessary thoughts and finally find out the secret of what is happening in this apartment. For a long time, they did not open the door for him, and he was already thinking about leaving. But suddenly, they answered him. It turns out that all this time the door was not locked, and the same thought appears to come to visit without an invitation. Strange sounds were coming from the apartment, asking for salvation, as if a robber or villain had come to their house. Now Kim has even more questions than before, and he is trying to understand what the hell is going on here. The main character wanted to apologize for the intrusion, when suddenly there was a terribly loud scream that forced him to quickly enter the apartment. Meanwhile, the blonde girl was sitting on the bed and diligently trying to play poker, thinking only about turning back because she had been playing for the second hour and there was no result. And then a terrible thing happens. The girl accidentally spilled water on the main character. It seems that he did not expect such a turn of events when he came here. It's immediately obvious that the girl was too tired after playing poker for a long time, but at the same time, she herself didn't understand why she was doing it. Of course, soon she finally notices the main character, who has been standing in her room all this time and her face changes at that very second. While she is just sitting in shock that there was someone else here, the guy is trying to explain to her that he came here because he heard very strange sounds. Maybe she needed help, and her door was also open. Judging by the sounds, it seemed to him that she was in danger. While the main character was talking about how this situation happened, the girl only thought that this was the handsome guy who lives next door. Since the situation was already too strange, our boy is going to quickly leave here at the speed of a flash. Of course, the lady is simply not going to let him go just like that, and quickly catches up with her Ayosi. 
But the girl accidentally grabbed his hand incorrectly, and so they both began to head towards the floor. The lady simply could not believe that the main character was still closing his eyes, especially after he had already seen how she played poker. The main character asked her for forgiveness and asked her not to report to the police. After that, the girl simply sweetly touched the boy's nose and said that of course she wasn't going to report to the police. But of course there was one thing. Suddenly the lady decided to make a very crazy face and asked Ajushi if he was good at poker. Of course, the boy sits in complete shock and simply doesn't know what he needs to do right now, and this ends the first chapter. Next, the actions return back to his apartment, where the boy sat calmly in front of his computer. Then he heard a knock on the door and simply could not believe that the girl really came to him. With every second, she began to knock on the door harder and harder, but he did not like this behavior because he could already hear her knocking perfectly well. He just runs out of the apartment and asks why the hell she's making so much noise here, but there was definitely not a blonde there but just a girl who was asking if he was coming out. Of course, the main character was simply shocked by this turn of events and was going to say that he was seeing this girl for the first time. Afterwards, she once again pokes his finger on his nose and says that she has already explained everything and even showed it to the boy. Even if that's the case, it doesn't change the essence. The boy still won't recognize her. But in response, she still continued to point her finger at him and told him to stop acting like a little child. The action moves back in time to when she asked about his ability to play poker, and then she realizes that she will need to tell everything first. Like a real Sigma, the main character simply pushes her to the side and tries to get away from here as quickly as possible, like some kind of zombie. Why the hell has the girl's appearance changed at all? What kind of black magic? What the hell? Suddenly the lady simply grabbed him by the leg, saying where was he going, and the main character demanded that she let him go immediately. The girl simply told him to wait a little, but the boy applied his secret technique, which was supposed to completely change his decision. But he didn't care at all. Once the plan has been implemented, the main character tries to run around. When suddenly he has to go back because the girl decided that it would be a great idea to call the police, she had already given the exact address. Suddenly the boy realizes that he cannot normally be in this situation, which is why he decides to go on a counter-offensive. The girl asks them to come as soon as possible, when suddenly the main character simply took the phone from her. The lady asked him not to panic because she would soon explain everything to him, so it was better to let her and her phone go. After this, our boy even tensed up because he had now completely stopped understanding what was happening. And so she calmly sat him down on the bed and basically told him a story that was not so easy to believe. The story is really incredible because she said that her appearance changes every four days. As it turns out, it doesn't just not change, but completely. And no matter how strange it was, it turns out that all those girls he saw turned out to be the same person. In his thoughts, he thought that he would never have believed such nonsense if he had not seen it with his own eyes. The boy decides to ask if she can get her appearance back. Well, of course this can be done. Only for this, she will need to wait about two more days or play poker eight or nine times. The boy thought that just waiting would be the best solution, and the girl confidently began to deny his statement. The whole problem was that after her appearance changes, she simply cannot work. The main character was too surprised because he thought that the girl was generally unemployed, but she did not understand what kind of strange reaction this was. In short, every time the madam plays poker to get her looks back, reality decides to slap her in the face and she can't handle it. After which she points her finger at our boy and says that he should become the person who will help her in such a difficult situation. After such a statement, the boy simply froze, realizing that he would have to play poker with this abnormal person. The appearance changes again, and she shows him the device for playing poker that the main character bought. Did he really buy them especially for her? In such cases, it was simply in vain that she went to buy these devices herself. It was so terribly awkward to buy them. But you can't tell from her facial expression that she's ever felt terrible or embarrassed. In any case, it makes absolutely no difference who bought what. No matter how you look at it, they use all these devices today. After which the main character is simply grabbed by the t-shirt and pulled towards the playing table, it seems that he is not very happy about this prospect. She just starts smiling like a real devil and says that they can definitely use everything they bought in the store. Next, the main character takes hasty actions, which causes him to make a mistake. In response, the lady asked him not to be so impatient. Actually, before playing poker, you had to undergo appropriate training, so now is the time to start it. While the lady was telling him all this, the main character himself sat in shock and did not know what to do. And in response, she simply told him to play carefully and not make any more mistakes, so it was time to start playing poker. This is not how our boy imagined his day. So far, he is just looking at her and trying to figure out what to do. Without thinking twice, he still starts the game and does it quite nicely. The girl also noticed that he turns out to be a very nice guy. 
Suddenly, the main character simply decided to stop preparing, but the girl said that most likely this would not be enough, and who told you that the boy had already finished, he just decided to warm up before playing. The girl said in shock that it was too strange. Yes, this was indeed an unexpected turn of events, because the boy was preparing for a poker game as if for a sports competition. After a short silence, the girl once again said that the guy is too nice and she can't swear at him because he takes the game so seriously. And by the way, this help will be very useful because they have to play damn poker about eight times. And finally, the preparation was completely completed, and now the lady says that the time has come to start playing. But the next chapter begins from the moment that the girl is crying, but it seems that she is crying from joy. The main character turned out to be just an excellent opponent in poker, so she liked the game so much that tears began to flow from her eyes. It was quite a long round and the girl was already tired. Maybe she should take a break, but it seems that the guy is not going to take a break. And this is the expression on the face of a person for whom everything definitely did not go according to plan. Now she should already be playing poker with the main character. The next round was already ready to come to an end, and it turns out that there wasn't much left for her to change her appearance. The main character plays like a real pro and knows all the right combinations, so that she doesn't even have the slightest chance of defeating him. Now she was already beginning to curse the boy because she didn't know how to play properly anyway, and now he was generally playing against her as if she were some kind of pro. She can't even remember how many rounds of poker they played. The boy realized that he had done something wrong and asked her for forgiveness. But in response, the lady said that on the contrary, it's good because now it's the main character who will help her change her appearance, like a real plastic surgeon. The expression on his face is clearly not happy, and now it's as if depression has set in. It seems that they are playing poker is not at all good news for him. Still, he looks at her for a long time and still agrees, and the girl sits with her face as if she was finally able to realize her brilliant plan. The main character brought a glass of water for the girl, and she immediately became much more joyful because a glass of water after such a long game is just great. She said thank you to her ajushi, at the moment, she simply cannot walk as if poker is like playing a sport, so she asked him to bring her water. Parnika simply covers her face with her hand so as not to see all that horror, but she doesn't understand what's so terrible about it. Everything turns out to be much simpler because the main character got a little carried away while playing poker and didn't even notice how he started playing too seriously. He was about to ask her for forgiveness when suddenly she said that he had absolutely nothing to apologize for because she liked playing poker with him. The girl herself did not expect that she would be able to play so many rounds of poker in a row, so she even needs to say thank you for opening up the world of poker to her in a new way. She thought that something was bothering the main character, because his face was too sad. But in response, he only said that everything was fine with him. When suddenly the lady begins to realize that she completely forgot to ask one very important thing, what the hell is his name? It was somehow strange for her to call him a Joshi, but if he doesn't care, then she can continue to call him that. And then the main character realizes that because of everything that happened, he completely forgot to even say his name. The girl's name is Yu Juhi, and she is 26 years old, but the boy can call her whatever suits him. In response, he simply says that his name is Kim Namju, and he is 26 years old, and the lady has just started getting ready. Ajosi is the name for a person who is older than you in age. The girl thought that it would be correct to call him that. Now the main character begins to worry about the fact that he looks too old. Does he really look that bad? but she thought that the boy was reacting too nicely to her jokes. In response, the lady simply said that she was actually joking and immediately began to get ready to move on. Now the girl will finally be able to concentrate on her work, and since they have already become such excellent opponents in poker, now she asks to take care of her. And she also started calling him Mr. Kim Namju. In response to such a request, the main character doesn't even have anything to answer. No words just emotions. She was about to leave, but her gait was just terrible. He asked if she was feeling okay after playing poker, and she simply said that she was fine. Of course, everything is not as good as it might seem at first glance, and after taking a couple more steps, the girl simply fell to the ground, causing the boy to panic. Now he had to turn into a personal delivery service and transport the girl back home. She asked for forgiveness for this, but the main character still believes that he should ask her for forgiveness. But for some strange reason, the girl always looks at him strangely, as if he is somehow strange. Finally, they came to her apartment. Fortunately, she lives next door and simply told him thank you. In parting, the girl simply said that they would definitely see each other in four days, so the doors immediately closed. Here, the boy's face becomes surprised again, because he begins to understand that he will have to repeat this poker game in exactly four days. The girl, as soon as she closed the door, did not move from her place, but simply stood there where she was. It seems that she too had a terrible shock from playing poker. 
She instantly just falls to the ground and begins to ask the question. He looked as if he had never played poker and did not understand the essence of gambling. What was wrong with him? What was not enough? But the lady was just thinking. Constantly playing poker with him when her appearance was constantly changing was too strange because they had not known each other for so long. Now she could only wait for the right moment until she needed help again. Here they start showing us a girl with green hair who was about to show off her new outfit. All this time the boy was here and was just waiting for all this to end as soon as possible. Judging by his facial expression, he clearly doesn't like being in this place. How did he even manage to end up here? She was just interested to know his opinion about her new image. Maybe he liked it. But the expression on the boy's face says something completely different. Maybe he likes the way she looked, but he just doesn't like being here at all. Further actions are transferred to two hours ago, when our main character was still at home and calmly drinking his morning coffee. All this time, he thought only about those four days that were supposed to pass. Suddenly, something strange begins to happen because the boy dropped his cup and tried to understand what the hell it was. In the corridor, someone shouted the name of the main character, and like a real Superman, he immediately ran to help and completely abandoned everything he was doing. He simply couldn't believe what was happening and asked if she really needed to break down his door every time. There was a lady in a pink jacket who invited him to go shopping with her. Seeing that lady there, the boy simply had no words left. Again, only emotions and the fact that he wanted to finish her off as quickly as possible. While he stood there and didn't understand why the hell she was here again, the girl said that they urgently needed to go shopping to collect new looks for her. She continued to talk about how she needed new images, but the main character didn't understand at all what kind of girl she was. She starts poking his finger right on the cheek and now everything becomes clear. This is Juhi, his abnormal neighbor who has once again changed her appearance. Everything has become a little more clear, but he still has the question of why the hell she comes so suddenly. When suddenly she talks about how all her old images have become too unsuitable for her, the girl somehow managed to find at least something normal from her closet. After another unexpected turn, the main character stands in shock and thinks that she always creates these cases on purpose. Of course it turned out awkward after all. The girl herself didn't expect that this could happen, but it's okay. She still tells him about the reason why they will have to go shopping, but the boy thinks that she could just tell him about everything. Still, she constantly had problems with things because her appearance changes all the time, so she needs to select new suitable images in response to this. The main character is silent here, Words are completely unnecessary. The situation has become completely clear, but Kim still doesn't understand why the hell she's going to take him with her. No matter how strange it may be, for some reason the girl simply doesn't understand how she can go shopping without him. After all, the main character was the only person who saw how her appearance instantly changed, and just yesterday he promised to help her deal with all her problems, so it would be nice if he agreed to help her. Or maybe the main character is going to just go back on his words and leave the poor girl in trouble. Of course now he just agrees because he wants to keep his word as a true Sigma. This was all great, but for now the girl is going to borrow a few things from his closet because her last ones just broke. It seems that the boy did not agree to help her with this, but only with the poker games. Whatever one may say, he still can't refuse to help his neighbor, so he agrees to give away a couple of his things. If so, he also needed to change his image a little, so he goes to his room first. All the same, those things that the boy handed her also turned out to be too inconvenient, but still they are much better than what she had. It's like he doesn't care at all what's going on in this crazy woman's head right now. He just spilled coffee on the floor so he cleaned it up with a vacuum cleaner. And she was simply shocked by his appearance and decided to ask what kind of outfit this was. In response, he said that there was absolutely nothing special about it because he took the first things that came to hand. He thought that something was wrong, and in response, she just said everything was fine, and it was time for them to hit the road. But as soon as she turned around, her face changed instantly, and she began to think that the main character was a real handsome man. It was just crazy. The boy didn't understand such a strange reaction, because yesterday he was called an old man. And now he thought that he also didn't know how to pick out clothes. His self-esteem was completely destroyed. The action returns back to the store, and the girl once again asked about how she looked in this outfit, the main character was in his thoughts all the time, which is why he was scared when he was called so suddenly. Looking at her new image, the main character was simply shocked and said that it was just great. It suited the girl very well. She couldn't understand why the hell the guy kept saying that everything suited her and told the consultant that she would take this too. The girl simply asked maybe he liked some other image that she could take. He didn't have an answer to this question when suddenly the consultant asked if he was helping his girlfriend choose clothes. The main character and the girl had a lot of questions and misunderstandings because now they really looked like a couple who were dating. She decided to eavesdrop on his conversation with the consultant and she continued to ask if he wants her to help choose things for her. 
Of course, the main character agrees to this proposal because he cannot choose himself. She simply asked to call him in case she suddenly needed her, and the girl from the other room began to call Kim to her. She just decided to make fun of the boy by saying that she had really managed to turn into his girlfriend. In response, he says that this was the most logical outcome of events because he cannot tell everything as it is. Kim will not say that they are actually friends who just decided to play poker, and he also asked for forgiveness if he offended her by this. All this time, the lady was completely sure that the boy was very shy, but it turns out that he also has strong character traits. And so our boy was once again left to just stand nearby and wait for the lady to come out. She simply peeks out from behind the curtain and asks the main character to come up to find out something. It turns out that she was in too difficult a situation and couldn't just choose, so she asked him to help. Of course, the boy is almost immediately going to abandon such an idea because he knows perfectly well how such help usually ends, namely, playing poker. But he still had no choice, so it was time to run to the rescue. Once there, the boy realizes that he himself is not able to help her. This is quite sad. Suddenly, the girl solves her problem herself, but the main character doesn't understand why the hell she called him if all this time she could have solved everything on her own. She simply comes up to him and says that she perfectly noticed the fact that the main character has been looking at a deck of cards all day today and definitely wants to play poker. The boy is simply shocked by such a statement. Of course, like a real Giga Chad, he immediately begins to ask for forgiveness because in fact, he did not want to look at the deck of cards. It just happened that way. But in response, the girl asked him not to apologize because she perfectly understands what it's like to want to play poker all the time. Apparently, it was too hard for him all day. When suddenly she says that it's time to play poker, which causes great surprise, let him just open the poker field and let the game begin. Of course, he simply cannot believe that she is really going to play poker right in the store. The lady's face immediately changed, and she thought that she had been too aggressive all this time, and such tactics might not work against him. She simply begins to remember the last time the guys played poker to repeat it, and then she begins to understand that she is not going to return to that moment when she had to play poker all alone. Here she begins to realize that she is using the main character as if she were her personal servant. Perhaps it was too much for him, and that's why he refuses to play poker. The girl just starts smiling at him and suggests that it would be a great idea if they played poker together right now. But the main character still continues to stand with an overly serious face, and then she realizes that the situation is completely different from last time. While this whole situation is happening, the boy just stands there and doesn't understand what's going on and the girl calls his name. Still, he covers his mouth with his hands and thinks that playing poker here might be too much. But the girl's thread of events has completely broken off and she is trying to understand what he will say next. The boy does not understand such a strange reaction and tries to find out what she said in a whisper under her breath. But everything turns out to be much simpler because no one is even going to ask the main character whether the poker game is about to take place, whether he likes it or not. She just makes a face like a demon and says that she knows perfectly well that in fact Kim wants to play poker. It's just that circumstances prevent him from saying what he really wants. Suddenly his face changes and he wants to give up this damn game by any means, but he definitely won't be able to do this. Then the lady begins to be even more surprised because the boy has not lost his abilities in the game at all. She thought that this time he played much better than in previous times, but the boy was not happy about it, but began to worry. Well, since the situation was already so great, the girl decides that there is absolutely nothing to lose, so the poker game begins and she makes a very cool combination. The main character simply cannot defend against such a powerful blow and therefore receives a fair amount of damage. By the way, he's just standing there in shock and trying to understand when this girl learned to play poker like that because last time he could beat her so easily but it turns out that she simply gave it her all. Poker is not ordinary, but magical, and here different combinations cause damage. The girl understood perfectly well that she simply would not be able to repeat all this again, so now she had to come up with something quickly. The game continues, and it seems that the chances are becoming less and less with every second, but she can no longer try. The main character turned out to be too strong. No matter how hard she tried to repel his attack, the girl still lost even after starting the battle with such a strong combination. And while this game continues, our video ends. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel and like so that the new part comes out as soon as possible.